that sucked. Went to a field this morning where we uh, put a bird to bed last night, big long beard all by himself. Read the script perfect this morning, had the decoys on the edge of the field, he was coming in gobbling. Trespasser cut us off, shot the bird right from underneath us. So after that we ended up leaving, I got hungry, we were going to the gas station to get some breakfast pizza. Um, <laughs> there's another field that we like to hunt, we've had, we've been pretty successful in this field a few times. Uh, so we're going to roll the dice and take a shot at it and hope we make something happen, stay tuned. Stay tuned guys, so hopefully we bring us some action. You know our morning was kind of shot so let's hope something happens this late morning. Hopefully the hens will go back to nest and uh, birds will start talking again. Bye. Man, 
that was intense. So last night we decided to go out and roost a few birds. We went to another spot of ours and found a bird in the corner of the field, watched it roost up. So we got out of there last night. Snuck in this morning, you know, got our stuff set up, working this bird hard early this morning. Uh, unfortunately, we had a trespasser on the property. He got between us and the bird, pretty close to the field edge, and he shot the bird on us. So, shot it right from underneath us. So, we uh, we left that property all depressed. Like, what are we gonna do now? You know, that was the bird we had roosted that night. Uh, we went and grabbed something to eat for breakfast, kind of gathered our thoughts a little bit, and decided to cruise up to a property that we had turkey hunted last year with Sam and. He had missed a big one up there last year. But we, we've had good luck up here with birds in the past. Went in here blind. We didn't even know what was what was in here this year. Uh, Cross the creek with the truck. Went up to the top field and right off the bat, Jake heard one gobble. I didn't even hear a gobble, but Jake heard one gobble. How far away was it at that point? Probably at least 100 yards. 100 yards that away. Was. So we had to kind of scramble, get set up. We could only set the decoys out 10 yards in front of us because the bird was already that close at that time that we didn't even have time to really get a solid setup going. So I, I had enough time to get my camera mounted on the tripod, start rolling, and uh, Jake hit the call maybe two or three times and, and uh, four, four ended up popping out of the field. Four big long beards. They weren't even Jake's. They were, every single one of them was a long beard. Uh, Jake told me he's... You know, there's coming, coming, and then he told me there was four coming, and uh, he told me to shoot the front, the lead one. He kind of jumped the trigger a little bit. Thank <laughs> Thankfully, I got my shot off while the, while the one was running away. I was able to peg him in the back of the head, put a little lead in the back of the head. But uh, yeah, it ended up working out. We didn't get a whole lot of pre-roll of the the birds coming in because they kind of came in on our blind spot, and thankfully they did because we were kind of hidden in a little cubby hole where where they were right on top of us before they even had a chance to see us and some real real thick stuff so yeah definitely wasn't expecting today you yeah know, we was... we thought today was going to be a wash <laughs> but uh went out this morning yeah, very huh? windy and... what, what what did that take us five minutes to kill those these birds if that if that maybe five minutes the best part about it is the same spot we set this afternoon and double up these birds two years ago we double up on does in the same spot so it was yeah, good memories. It man. was it was kind of a it's kind of meant to be, you know. We were <laughs> depressed. We we're real, you know. Karma kind of caught up to us on that one because we thought, man, a trespasser screwed us up opening day of turkey season, and actually did us a favor because if if that wouldn't have happened with that bird this morning, we wouldn't have doubled up on these two nice toms uh, late morning. So. I'm excited tomorrow. Let's go out tomorrow again. Yeah, let's go out tomorrow and see if we can get a couple more. Mm -hmm.